Let's go to a positive story of a Japanese trans woman who won a workplace harassment case. The government in Japan's Kanagawa prefecture has awarded a transgender woman work workplace compensation after recognizing her depression was a result of harassment she faced from her supervisor. Despite her requests, the woman's supervisor repeatedly refused to refer to her with female pronouns, which resulted in her taking leave from work and seeking mental health services. Japan has not ratified the International Labor Organization's convention dealing with workplace discrimination, but its national labor laws prohibit harassment based on sexual orientation and gender identity. So that's a really positive thing. They aren't following the kind of general guideline, but they do have strong enough guidelines that are, are there for protecting their employees. It's pretty surprising to hear a story like this coming out of Japan. And I, I'm, I'm very grateful to hear that this person was, was protected in this case.